guys how are you today I hope you're doing so well I am here with another design team video for my own product line the G Gina Aaron's product line over in my Etsy shop and I always do one of I do the videos every month with the team I don't just leave it up to them this month our prompt is washi tape washi so we're going to make some homemade washi tape and I'm going to use this opportunity to create some washi tape or art tape out of some different things I've just found around the house because you know we've been remodeling and I keep finding strange things hidden in strange corners. This is I believe medical tape, cloth medical tape. I had bunion surgery a few years back and before I had the surgery I used to like to do walks like the Avon walk for breast cancer in San Francisco which is a great cause and a great walk by the way. Um, but I had to tape up my bunions and you know everything yeah because it was painful so I think that's what this is. It's very old and sticky but we're going to use a um, silicone mat, non-stick mat here, non-stick craft mat, and I'm going to stick different kinds of tape to it. This is just masking tape. You want plain, uh, obviously, plain kind of tape. Um, this is not a new, this is not a new thing. This is an old thing. I'm only going to put one of that wide tape because I don't even know if it's going to work. It should work, um, and it should, yeah, peel up really easy. I'm going to put them kind of close together. Um, actually, I'm going to put another piece of that. And um, we are going to stencil and stamp on them and make our own decorative tape. I want to give you guys some ideas of what you can do. Now, if you don't have a non stick you're thinking, well, uh, that's great, great idea. I've got masking tape or some other kind of tape that would work, but I don't have a non stick mat. You can use parchment paper or wax paper, but I will be honest with you, I've had limited success. It doesn't always want to peel up well. I find these non-stick mats are really great. Now, I will also tell you, this is not a Ranger non-stick mat. This is a, um, this is from Amazon, and I cut it down to be the size so it would fit in my cookie sheet, because I use it for lots of different things. And then I can paint little things, or like make the washi tape. I can put the sheet in here and stick it up on my shelf to dry off of my desk, because my room is really little. I will, and they come in a pack of three and they were super cheap, so I will, um, that never works well. I will put a link in the description of the video so you can go down there and check it out. And maybe if you can't afford, if you're on a really limited budget, uh, maybe you want to go in with a couple of friends. And, and split it, because I, th I think they come in threes. I think I come in this color and I think white. All right. So now we need to get. We need to get.
Thank you.